Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I have been working on a collection of mods for 1.7.10 that, uh, once again, make the game far more difficult and a little bit more entertaining. So, let's go ahead and show you what it's going to be like. YouTubed. We're going to go with Survival. You can see nothing set here. And we're going to create the world. One of the things that I have set out in this one is making it challenging without making it completely deadly. And I say that because one of the earlier versions, I died six times in one night. Let me assure you, that was terribly annoying. So tone things down just a little bit from that. But one of the things I have established is that you'll see for a moment that the screen will demonstrate the world for just a moment, and then it'll ask me about the the Minecraft Comes Alive stuff. What it's doing at this point is randomly locating me somewhere within 3,000 squares of the origin, zero by zero. Every time you die, if you don't have a spawn point, you're going to randomly teleport somewhere whenever you start off. This is me randomly teleporting to 1,180X and 658Z, which is apparently in a desert. Hopefully I don't spawn on a cactus. Yes, that is totally possible. Oop, not on a cactus. I'm on a glacier. All right, get out of the rock, get out of the rocks. Whew, okay. So I have started out on a glacier. This <laughs> is great. All right, let's look at the journey map and see what's around me here. Uh, well, there's a village to the southeast. Given how deadly this world is, I think I'm going to head that way. And let's go see what this penguin wants to say. Hello. Is the world still lagging out here? Is anybody moving? Now, I have Thalmcraft in here, which I'm fairly certain that little thingy right there is uh, a magic point. Let's see here. Is there, are people moving? People don't really... Okay. Oh, polar bear. Do not mess with the polar bear. But I'll mess with the penguin. Ow. Wow, that's a thing vicious. Whoa, what's up with the lag? We get lag killed by a penguin. I get a feather out of it? Great. I'm dying and I have a feather. Wonderful. Alright, let's just get let's go over here. Let's try to avoid Mr. Polar Bear. Yes, I have the iguana tweaks on, which is why you see it say hurt up there in the upper left-hand corner. Because, you know, I'm hurt. Let's see. Um, oh, one thing I wanted to set up, which let me do that right now. Escape, open to land, allow cheats for a second. Game mode 2. That's right, I am doing this in... Now, save and quit out of it so the cheats I can turn off. Okay. Single player. You can see it just says survival mode. But now, if I attempt, wait, it let me, you can destroy snow in adventure mode? Hmm. Okay. You'll also see that I don't have to jump to climb up. That's another one of the mods that I have loaded up in here. Do, 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 do. See, another one, whoops, hello. Let's me right click to harvest crops. So I don't have to break crops. I just right click and collect them and they stay planted. What is this? Oh, this is one of those dungeons. Here, let me get down a level so I don't fall. Uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, yeah, see, I can't break blocks, so. And we get head on outside here. What have I got? Pays and carrots. I've got my some peas and carrots. All right, and some potatoes. All right, well, thankfully, it looks like food's not going to be too hard. Yay for villages. But until I can get myself a tool, you can see that my carrying capacity, though, is much lower than it would be. You'll also notice that I move pretty darn fast. I did increase the base movement speed so I don't have to run everywhere. Hello there. You're not viciously trying to attack me after what I did to your cousin, right? Good, good. I'm sure it was just a misunderstanding. I thought he was a different guy in a tux. Alright. Now then. 
Let's see. Does anybody here want some carrots? What's in here? Ooh, good. Oh, hello, guys. Hello, Kimberly. All right, I need a stick. I'm uh, not going to find a stick in here. What's this? A copper pickaxe head, a blue slime pickaxe I'll grab a blue slime pickaxe head. Why not? And I'm going to grab the stone binding. What else do I need to make? That's not going to be flint. I'll grab an obsidian shovel head. Then I want a bronze wide guard. And is there a blade in here? I see no blades in here. Hey guys, it's gone. Nothing in there. Oh! A wooden sword blade, a bone knife blade, a oh, cactus sword blade. Here we go. An obsidian binding instead of a stone binding. We'll take that instead. So... We're going to put all the stuff in here. Just in case something horrible happens to me. Alright, so I need to get some sticks. Why are you guys all angry? I'm putting stuff in there. Alright, I need sticks. How am I going to get sticks? I'm going to need some wood. I can't collect wood, since my attempts at collecting wood go like that. So I'm going to have to get creative. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to talk to you. Let's see here. Let's go here. I'm going to put these in here for right now. Why do I have a wood crossbar? I don't want that. Bone knife blade. There. Now then. There is no room left in here. Actually, let's go grab carrots. Because at least carrots I can eat relatively raw. Now let me show you. If you hold down shift, you can see how much you get for each one of these. It's a half a meat stick and a half of uh, whatever that other thing's called. Okay, why is everybody following me in here? Really? You guys not have anything better to do? You folks are stuck. Hmm. Hey, vicious penguins. Sorry. My apologies, Destiny. Okay, I need to figure out a way of getting some wood. Alright, well, I can look around for something that will destroy a tree. In the meantime, I'll just collect this stuff because it's handy. And it won't pop off because I'm not actually breaking the stuff. Alright, let's look around. There's also a ton of interesting mobs added in. Penguins, of course, are normal. Those things are not. I don't even know what it's called. I'll know if one kills me. Hello. Are you hostile? I'm going to say no. Ooh. Whoa! What the heck is that? What is that thing? Okay. Whoa! What is that thing? Hello! Dodge! Dodge! Yo! Guys! Help! There's something really bad coming after me! Guard! Guard! Help me! Help me! There's something bad coming around the corner. Yes. Something really bad. It's right over here. It's coming. It's coming for me. Would you please kill it? Oh. Oh. Fudge nuggets. Fudge nuggets. Help. Kill it. Kill it. Why are you not killing it? Oh, great. Okay. What is this thing? Okay, for some reason it can't seem to... Oh! 
Ow, 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 fudge. Whew. Okay, well. Yeah, that'll get me some well fed. Hi. Come on, regenerate. I don't even know what this thing is. What are you so mad for? Ow. It's a clink. Okay, well, now I'm going to respawn at some random point very far away. Ah, see, I uh, was at 1,372 by 71. Now I'm in the negatives. So once again, it adds a de level of difficulty because you never know where you're going to end up if you die. So all that stuff that I collected is way far away. All right, let's get up here. Now I can't collect the cactus, right? Nope. And of course there's those things. Those are not happy things. They don't even look like nice happy things. So we're going to avoid the angry looking things. What's this? Oh, I can click that. What is it? Aloe vera. I don't know what it's used for. Let's see. Oh, that looks like a pyramid. Maybe I can actually find like a sword or something in there that I can use without dying horribly. Well, if I die horribly, I'll end up somewhere else. Let's check the journey map. Let's see here. See, here's where I am. There's all those things in there. I have things that add additional zombies into this. So, oh, crud nuggets, it's about to get dark. Well, if it's getting dark, one of the safest places is probably inside this thing. See if I can figure out how to get in. Okay, let me guess, the way to get in is down. Ow! Stupid ostrich! And I'm dead again. Here's another death, over there. Where's my first death? My first death is way over there. Oh, it's nice that I have markers from where I've died. Oh, okay, so apparently this is where I was supposed to originally spawn. What is that? Night bloom? Some kind? I don't know. Anyway, got vo ver vicious, ferocious ostriches. Ostrich? Ostriches. We'll say ostriches. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, you know, words are hard. All right, let's see, let's look around. Hey. Yep, yellow attack back. I need food. And you provided me no food. Okay, no more attacking armadillos. Okay, what do I have on the journey map now? There's a death. I am here. Well, I like how I have beacons as to my deaths. Apparently I'm going to have a large collection. Oh, you notice they're killing each other. That's because when there's more than one male, they will attack each other. Where are, where are you going? Oh, hey, there's another village. Okay, let's go over that way. Oh. Okay. All right, so it looks like I picked up pieces of from one of the... Whoop, whoop! Whoa! Running, running! Seriously, those things... <laughs> those are mean! Okay, that one over there's got a name. That makes it even worse. What is that thing called? Looks like Verdant something Alpha. All right, I'm not getting too close. Let's just go over here. With the, you know, boost in speed. Hi. Nope, don't want to be in there. I'm just, I'm just looking for somewhere to hide. Oh, look, monsters. These are a different kind of zombie. <laughs> Do I have anything interesting in here? Don't mind me, I'm ignoring the zombies. Okay. Okay. 
Once again, put everything of interest in the chest. And there are no sticks. I still need sticks. What is that thing? Dark something. Whoa, get away. Whoa, he's fast. Whoa. Oh, that's a hero, Brian. Oh. Well, that would have been handy to know a second ago. I could have used that to get some wood. Oh, hello. I know, you want me. Oh, and here comes an inch. Whoa! Whoa, come on. Oh, no. Now I get to fight at a weapon. Whoa. Okay. <sighs> Another death to add. Killed by the haunted tool. Uh, that would be the blue one. Okay. So I guess only your first start out is random. It's not what I intended, but... Oh, well. Oops. Let's go this way. Another little magic thing over here. What is? Why are there people over here with names? Hello, folks. Whoa! Why are all of you sleeping here? I'm just gonna walk this way. Okay. Get away! Get away! Man. As you can see, the world's a dangerous place. Okay, let's just run a little bit farther. Look back, nothing. Okay. Oh boy. What are you guys? Okay. Cyborg zombies. That's right. I remember reading about them. Oh, wait. Okay, staying alive, staying alive. Okay, in the water, I am a little bit safer. Another one. Oh my, and all the zombies. What is this guy? Okay, well. I guess I'll just stay here in the water and get out of the water. Okay, I'll just circle around you guys and punch you for a while. Okay. There we go. You guys must be seriously armored. I'm getting hungry. Okay, you won't go in the water. That's a good thing. Okay, killed one. And that guy over there just... Oh, hello. I got a redstone and a redstone repeater out of that guy. That's right. Ding, ding, ding. Hmm. Hey, he gave me a jukebox. Two jukeboxes. Okay. That one's dead. You are completely worthless, so I'm just going to get out of the water and get away from you. Alright. Where's my stuff? Oh, crudtastic. Hey, okay, creeper. You need to help me. Over here. Over here. 
Come on, you. Yep. Ooh. Okay. Over here. Come on. I need to blow this place up. Yes! I have wood! I will be able to go forward. Oh, I almost built the house I was trying to save. Alright. It's almost morning. Okay. Must stay alive. Must stay alive. Staying alive. Okay. So. Sticks. Excellent. Okay. Uh, what do I need? First, I need to make a pickaxe. Okay. Here's an iron axe head. That's good. That's not what I need. I need... Nope. And there it is. Axe head. Six. I can finally cut some wood down.